My name is Anova from the Assessor with Finchley College. Today is 16th of July 2023. Confirm my name and date. Uh, Roberto Silva, today is 16th of the 7th of 2023. Okay, um, uh, what I'd like to do is to do a resection. You know the appeals procedure? Sorry? If you're happy with my assessment decision, you can appeal to me first. Okay. If you're not happy, you can appeal to our internal verifier. If you're not happy, you can appeal directly to the warning body, okay? Okay. So, uh, you've set up a total station and you've leveled it. Well done. I want yes. to do a resection. You've... Okay, I want to do me a resection. So press OK. Uh, I've created a job already with for today. So, I go to set up, uh, press the resection, press OK. And then point ID is going to be the station number. So, we can write STN1, for example. The height will be zero. Mm -hmm. Then we press OK. And then we're gonna point to our targets R1, for example. Make sure you do single shot. And, uh, just point to the target. Make sure you point it straight, right in the middle. Can you do two face measurements? I can do it, yeah. Yeah. So just press measure. Now it's gonna turn to the second face. Yeah, I'm done. We point again to make sure it's in the center and we measure again. After you're gonna okay. select the next target, it's gonna be R2. We point to it again. Press measure again, and it's gonna turn for the second phase. We make sure it's on the center again. And we press measure again. Normally if you survey two points, if you wanna to turn to the third one, the instrument should turn automatically. Point again for the center to make sure. Are these targets in good location? Uh, you happy with the position and accuracy? I'm not very happy with this one. The handle is not very good. It's on the post? Yes. Yeah. It's also, also not very stable. Okay. So what is a, a good position? So be straight to the instrument in a place where there is no movement. For example, in the side will be any exclusion zone. Mm -hmm. So. No, we just put the, the targets outside of the exclusion zone where we're working. Yeah. Measure three. It's going to be our third target. And then if you want to check the resi residuals of our total station setup, we press calculate. Yeah. We go to quality. And we can see you got very nice quality. Perfect. Well done. Post and then we're set. Well done. And the total station is set. Good. Great. Well, uh, what sort of accuracy do you ex expect on site? Accept? Uh, I would not accept nothing more than three millimeters, let's say. Three uh, if it's to do grid lines or setting out windows, no more than two, one mil. And what do you think causes that three mil? Uh, the uh, target can be in bad location, so it can be moved. Uh, as well, we can be shooting a target instead of shooting reflect instead of shooting reflected table, shooting reflectless, different prism. Uh, maybe the station is not level as well. A lot of mm -hmm. factors can temperature as well. A okay, I will say temperature. Can you apply atmospheric correction? Yeah. So if you go to settings, you go to TS instrument, and we go to atmospheric corrections, and it says now. Can you check that the temperature for today on your mobile. Yeah, I can check today. So I think it's 20 degrees around my mobile with me. But it's 20. It's not going to make too much difference uh, in terms. If it's extremely hot, yes, or if it's extremely cold. So we can see that now, if I go back to atmospheric corrections, that the pressure, humidity, atmospheric BPM will change. Can you check depending. all that on your mobile? What's the temperature and humidity? Yeah, we can check as well, yes. Can you check? Yeah. I don't have my mobile. Oh, okay, yeah. we'll do it later, okay. Um, I'm using your camera, so yeah. okay. Never mind, well done, you've done very well. Uh, so what's the purpose, what's the reason for doing this? 
the purpose is if he's if he's shooting targets doing measurements at close range it's not going to interfere too much but if you're measuring so let's say targets at 100 meters uh the temperature is going to affect a lot so that's why we need to change the temperature it's a big distance measurement yeah. well done okay thank you very much you've done very well thank you thank you